sci-fi stories through role-playing games. Previously on the Eden Program. You awake in a dimly lit room. I, I don't remember how we got here. I don't remember anything. If we're the only three people, we need to trust each other. I want to know what the factory actually is. You see the old man rumpled in his chair, fiddling with the device. Warning, intruder alert. You burst through the front door. You see the security vehicles headed your direction. The Devil in the Garden. You scurry across the street um, in order to get away from the oncoming what appear to be police officers, security. Um, do they, black do they look human or robot? You can't tell. The um, the windows are entirely black on these giant Hummer-like vehicles that are coming your direction. It's a security on the side. Um, Can we tell if there's exhaust coming out the back? Do they run on gas There is, actually. They are gas-powered, yeah. Um, You find yourself across the street, sort of down a a side street, and you stand in front of what appears to be a convenience store. There is projected onto the window, onto the glass itself, an advertisement. And around you on other, um, what appear to be flat surfaces, Various other videos playing. They are of humans. They are um, well acted. And um, surprisingly, they appear to be talking to you almost conversationally. And it it, it kind of surprises you because they're speaking to you by name. Hmm. So Uh, are are our name tags possibly being picked up in terms of... Can I elect- electronically? Using, can I hear them using his name, or is it always just mine? No, it's always yours. It's always mine. Oh. Are the ads talking how, to you, too? How do they know my name? Do oh, they know your name, too? I'm hearing what my name. I'm only hearing my name. Targeted ads is the way of the future, I guess. Do you see, uh, what, what do you guys see on the screen? I see them talking to me. Right, but, like... I hear, I see and hear them talking directly to me. Like, that was an ad for a candy bar. Did you guys just see an ad for a... For Murph Murph? Yeah. No, you didn't. You, you, yeah, I saw, you saw an ad for electronic uh, uh, equipment. Okay. I said, that's why I say I saw an ad, an ad Joe, for computer equipment, I guess. Yeah, for, for computer I equipment. I saw an ad for computer equipment. Yeah, I saw an ad for uh, art installation. Yeah, you did. Um, and now that one's going away, and there's like apparently some sweet guitar um, being played. It's almost like a music video or something. Is it like a. Is it a guitar I recognize, or is it like. I, it's one you would love to have. You don't know why. While this, while this is happening, I reach out and I touch my two companions to make sure that they actually have physical uh, uh, presence. No, we're real. I think we're real. They, they're real. Yeah. Why don't we keep... Sorry, moving? I had to check. I know. However, the image is not. Um, it's, mm-hmm. it's, not a, it's not a hologram. Oh. It's literally not there. What? It's in our heads? You appear to be seeing it through some kind of augmented reality. I close one eye. Yup. Um, the, the 3D aspect of the image goes away when you do that. The foreshortens. And uh, you, you, you're on to them. Okay. <laughs> well, here you stand in front of the convenience store. I check my, chain, my pockets for change. None. None. Do we even have pockets? Do we know about the existence of nachos? <laughs> yes. This is not the time for nachos. And, in fact, you... Discover that you are extremely hungry. Hey, what are we going to pay with? Hmm. Is well, these are ads, right? Mm-hmm. They have to have prices listed. What? Are, what is the currency? Is it a symbol we recognize? Um, do we have pockets? I guess we never. You do our not pockets. have pockets on, on these jumpsuits. But um, at the end of the ads, uh, what you're noticing is like there's an ad for vacation, and the reference to pay apparently is the verb scan. It's just scan, scan, scan. I check my wrist. 
Well, I already checked for marks at the very beginning, yeah, didn't, and I didn't. You didn't, didn't, didn't have any. No. I checked. My, I I didn't, we didn't find any. There's right. a difference. I roll up my sleeve. Nothing on the arm. Roll up the other sleeve. Nothing on the arm. I'm gonna walk into the convenience store mm-hmm. and where the cash register is. Okay. Is there like is it somewhere? some kind of a clicker or a palm scanner or something? Yeah, there's a hand scanner. Hand scanner. Wait, mm-hmm. is there no one working inside the convenience store? Yeah, he is. Oh, it's not even a barcode. It's it, just it appears room. to be a bored teenager. I wave. He how is, acknowledges you. How is he dressed? I carefully examine the way that he's oh. dressed. Is he similar clothing to us? Yeah, t-shirt, kind of a, a popped collar kind of thing. Oh, so he's dressed like a casual He's got clothing. some... Oh, yeah. I mean, he's a, he's a store attendant's clerk. I mean, Horrible he looks, he looks bored out of his mind. James, we need to be really careful here because we're clearly not dressed the way that we should be dressed. We're going to stand out. We, we may Maybe we, coming in here is not a good idea. Maybe we should go find a department store. I, I'm, I'm still really outside hungry. the store. I want to look around and see if there's like a clothes store nearby. Sure, absolutely. <laughs> Sirens in the distance. Nope, nope. Mm. Uh, actually, you see one of those Humvees go right past the street um, and kind of cruise to a stop, and they appear to be getting out and heading towards the facility. The facility, not us. The facility. Okay. That's good. But we, and, and this kid hasn't really noticed us because he's not really paying attention. He's so, barely acknowledged your existence. That's good. That's good. I've stuck behind a shelf or something. Yeah. Well, I want to find a clothes store. Okay. A clothing store? Yeah. Yeah, I think that is a good idea, though. We should All right, probably so those are your place. stakes? Uh, one success? Two successes. Okay, yeah. Um, there's a clothing store just across the street, a couple stores down. Um, the, the street itself is entirely empty. Um, you see an automated... Um, it almost looks like... Uh, I don't know, kind of a Roomba, a giant oversized Roomba, just come down the street and turn and go away. But That's um, terrifying. Yeah. Colony of cats on top of it. <laughs> <laughs> but uh, you, you, don't, you don't see any people per se um, until you walk into the store, and then there, there's a, a well dressed, almost butler type man uh, who looks at you and he says, "Can I help you, sir? Need a need a, a new set of clothes for." Yeah. Uh, Job interview. Uh, yes, indeed. And, and he glances um, at you. And it, it is it, clearly you do. And then he says, "I'm I'm sorry, sir. Is is that your name?" Yes. Well, Mr. Black, I. It's a pleasure to meet you. Thank. Oh, uh, I was not aware that you were saved. Very recently. Yes. Well, congratulations on being born again. Yeah. If I might say, uh, I'm quite a fan of your work. Thank you. Uh, I, I, your your last album, oh, what's it been now? 30 years? I think even longer. Hmm. Uh, perhaps, perhaps. It, it's, been, it's been a long time since I've done that kind of thing. But uh, now, it's, it's worth mentioning, this guy's maybe in his 30s. Yeah. Um... Uh, I'm, I, I remember, <laughs> if you will indulge me, uh, I remember uh, going to one of your concerts live. Really? Yes, yes. That was oh, well before any of us uh, had ever dreamed of Eden. Things were different back then. But I, I must say, I, <laughs> if, you'll, if you'll excuse the impropriety, it, <laughs> I'm just so overwhelmed to be to be in your presence. Uh, my understanding was that um, you had a uh, little difficulty. Why do you think I'm looking for new clothes and meeting some, you know, contract people? Trying to get back in the business. Right, right. And they, they didn't take care of you at the center? There were complications. I see. I see. Well... By all means, um, over here are the the suits and uh, the 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 the, tie, the ties. Um, <clears throat> and um, will we be needing a, a jacket as well? Uh, of yes, course, of course you will. If, if you'll just help yourself um, and look around, I'll, I'll be right back. Ray, right, we need to get the hell out of here because this guy's going to go hit, trigger some sort of alarm and send the security over here. I don't trust this guy at all. I who am I? What? Uh. But Ready, pull yourself together. Uh, <laughs> is this where we get slapped? We still need clothes, though. I mean... Just take them. Let's go. We'll, I... we'll change in the convenience store. That 
that kid didn't seem like he noticed. Like, did, did that guy seem like he was going to go call someone? Like, he hurried away, and he, to me, Freddy, it seemed like he hurried away, and... Is that just you being paranoid, or do you have some other reason for trying to get us out of here? I just don't trust that guy. I, 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 he seemed to be, to be concerned. Yeah, what, why, should, why should I trust you? Let's get a read on him. Go ahead and... Find eye for detail? Yeah. No successes. Two successes. Okay. Uh, oh, yeah. He was... Um, very, very quickly, his demeanor switched from hero worship to something is wrong here. I, and I uh, grab he, a jacket. He's gone off. into the back to to make a. I grab a hoodie. Call. I grab the first hoodie that looks like it would fit me and run out with yeah. That. Okay, well, that's kind of in a different department. But on the way out, you spot somebody. Yeah, I try to grab some sort of like jacket or something. You just put over the one. Is there a palm scanner? There is actually. Yeah, I swipe my hand across it real quick. Okay, it says thank you. Freddie Black. Actually, Frederick Black. Yeah. Because <laughs> that's your technical name. Uh, do um, I have an embarrassing middle name? Probably. Like Aloysius or something. Yeah, I put my hand over that. Um, um, and um, then it, it shows the amount that, that you've been credited on your account. How many digits? Um, and it also tells you, well, it, it's it's a significant amount. You chose a, a rather nice um, piece of clothing. But does it show me how much money I have in my account? That's the interesting thing, is the remaining balance is um, millions of... Guys, I'm a millionaire. Can He's... you can you count me on this jacket? <laughs> uh, here, let me hold it. Why? <laughs> Done. I quickly grab like just a pair of cargo pants and like a button-down well, shirt. Well, well, how much money do you guys have? I figure that that you already took the initiative and scanned your hand. I don't think that either of us need to have our identities known just yet. You've already been introduced to one of the people in these in this place. All right, all right. I think uh, while that may have been a colossal mistake, we're just gonna have to move past it. It would cause more suspicion if we stole something, right? I think so. Yeah. So I'm going to put on my hoodie as we go out, leave the store. Your non-suspicious hoodie. Fantastic. Yeah, and I've got Does it have an embarrassing logo on it or some band name? Oh, yeah. It's got, it's got like a sports team. I know. It's terrible. Um, but, yeah, you, you walk out and um, you head on your way. Which direction are you going to go? Wait, are we going back to the community? Where are the obvious food? exits? The obvious exit. Yeah. Well, I mean, this this is a main exit out onto the street. I mean, this was a corner department store, so you can basically pop back out onto the same street that the uh, complex was on, or you can keep going down that side alley that you were on before. Let's, or you can head out the back way, go through the store, and try to pop out somewhere else. It, is yeah. there street food? Is there a directory? <laughs> I know we were looking for food. Okay, you guys are still hungry. Is right. there a directory? Directory? No. Or like a phone boot. I want to find a place of information, like okay. a library or a museum or something. Oh, okay. Like uh, that's what I'm going to be looking for. Okay. I want to. Think, Those are your stakes in the next scene. I want to think of a place of information. Okay. And see what I see. Okay. Those are your stakes. You're, you're hungry. Um. Well, I know that we we were all hungry, so. I have more pressing concerns than hunger right now. Right, I, I do think that we should continue to, to get out of here. So I think um, my stake, I guess, is just going to be I'm going to try to be um, to look around the street, be very hyper vigilant about what sort of people mm-hmm. are passing mm-hmm. by, any sort of possible security, because I know this guy may have called someone. And I'll also try to hurry them along. Um, no, we're know, hurrying. Away from this department store. You know, it's like you look for information all you want, but we got to look for it away from this department store. Yeah. Okay. And you, you in your mind palace are going to have to do it. <laughs> uh, yeah, I have no problem with that. That's a right. beautiful mind. <laughs> so there's your stakes. Uh, one for you guys, okay. plus whatever you um, choose to tap in terms of edges and that sort of thing. And he's got a three natively. So I'm not spending any budget for this. I have no successes. One success. One Nothing. success. Tell us what happens. So we still hear sirens. A lot of sirens. Mm-hmm. Like, way more sirens than seemed necessary like we don't know how many sirens they're coming from a different direction now as well yeah and we're still getting like as we pass by different stores and stuff and they they still do ads they're still targeting those ads and i catch out of the corner of my eye one targeted ad that does seem interesting a bookstore mm-hmm. on uh on, like a general bookstore like i want to say barnes and noble but i need a better name like a non noble and barnes there we go books and stuff books and stuff yeah, you know what? Books and stuff. Very nice. Very nice. 
<laughs> guys, guys, I got an idea. Um, and the ads talk to us, right? They do. I ask it where the closest uh, books and stuff is. Oh, thank you there. Thank you. And I follow its direction. Yeah. This way, guys. So every flat surface, that individual, kind of a, a pretty teenager girl uh, who looks like a, a bookstore attendant, is, is walking along with you. This way. And she, she motions. Every corner you turn, she's already there waiting for you. Kind of creepy. Yeah. So he looks like he's just seen and talking to no one from our perspective. Right? Yes, that's correct. Well, You've still got people talking to you, You've still got other ads, but... That's true. Um, as we're walking along, you spot uh, another one of those Humvees at the... Like, behind us. Mm-hmm. Like, two blocks away. And for a moment, it looks like it's about to turn. And then it doubles back and leaves. Good. I warn the rest of you that yeah, it is. I put up my hoodie. This was this is a pretty close call. Yeah, we need to hurry along to the books and stuff. Yeah, you find yourself in the books and stuff, um, vigilant out the windows for security should it arrive. But um, what is your goal here? History of music. Yeah, interesting. Well, the very first thing that you notice is that these books. They aren't books. No, oh, they they're... are slates. They are. Um, just sort of clear plastic um, panels oh, of, we... of sorts. Don't worry, I can I can operate them for you. Oh, I was with hoping my for like skills. discs from the time machine that you spin and they talk to you. Yeah, yeah. yeah. no. Oh, uh, but as you pull one out, um, you as you look at it, the text is there, and you're able to to flip past it, kind of like a haptic. Yeah, it really is. You get the idea that what you're purchasing here is the content, not necessarily the. The, the physical thing. Slate, uh, slate. Because there's only one for each book. Right. Um, I look for, like, a general, like, for one book that and it has, like, rock and roll of the last 50 to 100 years. Okay. You found it. It's a uh, compendium of rock and roll. And it's I awesome. flip back to the index to find the bees. And there you are. And I flip to that page and see, look at my bio and see what it says about me. Um, well, it it's interesting because there's actually a whole chapter on you, um, and it's called The Rise and Fall of Freddie Black. Guys, I don't like this. And I don't remember falling. Um, you can either purchase it and take it with you, or you can try to summarize it here and now really fast. I'm going to do the purchase. Okay. So, um, you can just make the purchase right there on the slate. It's just a thumbprint in that case for low-level content, and you'll be able to peruse that at your leisure. Did he buy just that chapter and not the whole book? Did he buy the whole book? He doesn't know. How, how does how does the search function work in oh, this place? Intuitively. So are we? Can I just like literally just search for my name and see if there's a book that has anything with my name in it? Uh, yeah, go into one of the kiosks. You can certainly attempt it. It's Bing. Hmm? It's Bing. Okay. So so Bing Bing is, in the future Bing has won. Is there a specific thing you'd like to do in this store while you're guys? Look up your names. Yeah, look that's, that's yes, I agree. I'm going to be looking up transit methods. Okay. Or actually, no. I'm going to look up um, city records on the Eden Eden program. Program. Yeah. Interesting. Okay, I've got it. I've got two cards out. One success. Okay. One success. Nothing. And I have two successes. So you're not able to find anything. You find the you find the search function to be confusing at best. It doesn't really? appear to be alphabetical. Or any kind of Dewey Decimal System. It, it appears to be using the uh, the Herkimer Decimal System, hmm. which is you have no idea, no clue. No, you don't know Herkimer. Great guy. Yeah. So what do um, we do? We're gonna have to take it with you and get out of here because um, you have just watched the security I, forces. I sh- about no. five men uh, and one of them actually is, is a woman. Um, have just burst through the front door. I, I should also mention, by the way, that when I was searching for my name, I was searching for random names as well. Okay. Just to clarify. Sure, yeah. So, in their system, it's not just my name that was searched for. It was multiple names. Fair enough. Um, this place is shut down. You hear one of the That's apparently in-charge people scream. Were, are there any other shoppers in here? Yeah, a couple. Hmm. Two or three. Is there a back door? You have no idea. What are the other shoppers doing when they when the security comes to the front and um, starts yelling? They, they look a little surprised and, and kind of, I don't know, almost entertained or amused. Yeah, we need to find a back door to this place and get get out of here right now. Quietly. Okay. 
I'm running to the back. Sarah Schumer? Who said that? Sarah Schumer? Was that you? Did you hear that? I heard something. Sorry. Sorry for what? Can you hear me? Yeah? Hang on. Is this better? Yeah? Excellent. We've been trying to get through to you. What's... Who... Listen, I don't have time to explain. Uh, you, you've got to get out of here. Got any bright ideas? Yeah, you need to go up as high as you can and out the fire escape. Fire escape. Let's go. Upstairs. So uh, I, book it. They haven't seen you yet. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna keep my head down below the level of the bookcases or bookshelves mm-hmm. and head for the stairs. Okay, let's see if you can do this without being spotted. All right. Uh, so I have one success. Hey, you can choose to you can choose to split up, be together, follow him. I've got one card. <laughs> okay. Yeah, I only have one card as well. Well, don't forget about your edges. I don't have any that apply. Here. Okay. Yeah. I'm gonna go ahead and say since I'm a, I'm a paranoid person anyway that I probably have some sort of like sneakiness or like um, covert stealthy type like inclinations. Sure, that sounds great. So I'll take that as my other edge. So I'll get another card for this as I try to sneak out. I'm not gonna follow him. Really? You're gonna stay? I'm, I'm gonna. I'm going to blend in. Nice. Um, by you reading. Blend a book. into the crowd of the other two people. By by reading a book. By reading a book. Yeah. Like, I'm going to completely ignore them. Okay. While well, wearing a onesie with a jacket. No, no. Because remember, I grabbed like cargo short. You were in jorts. No, I grabbed cargo pants and like a, a just a button-down shirt and just threw that on over it. Cool. Cool. <laughs> so you plop into an easy chair or something. Yeah. Okay. Can I have one success. Okay. I have two success. Very nice. Everybody succeeds except for me. They fan out and they start a row by row search. And so um, you can tell these guys are really methodical. And so you head towards the last row and out. Nobody sees you. Nobody spots you. That you can tell. Is the voice still talking to me? Yes. He is guiding you. Quick, dodge left. Okay, duck. <laughs> um, now, um, it's, you're going you're gonna to have to jump. Um, jump where? To the next roof. How far is that? Uh, 23 feet, but it's lower. Are we hearing him as well? Or no. Is, you, you just hear me, uh, my half of the conversation. Oh, 23 feet. Oh, great. Okay. Yeah, sure. I can jump that. He's coming. You've got to go Oh, uh, yeah. I'm going to start jumping right now. Let's go. Let's go. Let's go. All right. I want you to head uh, northwest. I'm, I'm following him, by the way, with this stuff. Northwest? Yeah. The, uh, the, only, the only vehicles in this city are uh, the security and I think one other. So I'm going to try to, hit, to get you there. All right. Uh, so what, what, what happens when I get to the other roof? You're going to jump. Keep jumping across rooftops? Yeah. All right. That's what I do. Uh, you see those tubes? Yeah. Try to stick to those. Careful. They're slippery. On them? On them. Okay. What's in these tubes? Um, well, they're walkways. Some are used for parcels, but okay. why, why does it matter? Freddy, what, what is going on? Someone's you lost talk- your mind. Someone's. Who are you? Um, I'm. I'm Joe Stevens. No, there's a voice in my head. Sorry. Oh. Someone knows me and is trying to get us out of here alive. Where? Where? Where'd James go? My I, name's, my I name's strangely Philemon. believe that. Your name's what? Philemon. Should I recognize that name? Yes, uh, I've you? told you my name before. <sighs> I think you tweeted. Oh, sorry. Though. You're talking to your. Oh, you're talking to your voice in your head. Sorry. Technically, we've met, but you wouldn't remember it. I don't remember much of anything. It, it, somehow I'm a rock star and I have millions of dollars. <laughs> yeah. Well, and I'm supposed to be dead, maybe? You. It's it's difficult to to explain. Um. Listen. Uh, what 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 do you remember about the um, New Eden Project? I I remember waking up in a waiting room. No 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 not 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 the Eden program, the New Eden Project, Oop, the space program. What do I remember? Can I... Yeah. I, I want to try to remember anything if, if something gets unlocked. Yeah, I'm not going to spend anything. All right. Uh, I failed. Three successes. Oh, wow. Um, nothing is the answer. Okay. Uh, but you are confident that you know nothing. I, I don't know anything. And I know that that's not me forgetting something. I know it's just... It's not something I remember. Or was a part of, I think. Wow. So, so Job was right. He was right the whole time. Job's right here. <laughs> yes, I'm right here. What's going uh, on? 
What do you know about the new Eden? Okay. Um, well, let me just lay it out for you. Uh, turn left here and go straight 300 feet and then jog right. Um, okay, you are not um, your mind. You are a... Clone? Reborn... Ooh, that's such a dirty word. Um, digitization, shall we say? Um, reintegration of the physical form of your predecessor whose physical makeup and genetic material uh, informed your pattern is dead. Uh, no, I mean, he was, he was deintegrated. Um, what does that part entail? Of the, that's part of the process. Well, to... They... There's there, 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 there's a, a chamber and you're uploaded and then deintegrated, reintegrated, and when you emerge, then um, as long as you're saved, then you're downloaded. And if it, you're not, if you're not what saved, well, that's impossible. You, everyone's saved. I mean, <laughs> everyone in the city. That's what we're doing out here. That's why I'm bringing you to us. So, so there's no one that doesn't get saved. Not. Not in the city, not legally. Listen, um, Stevens, Joe Stevens, he he always theorized that um, if somehow the upload process wasn't allowed to continue, that the the the, the new versions would um, have mm, ascensions, a soul, if you will. That wasn't <laughs> their pat- original. Patently ridiculous, of course. Um, except I'm talking to you, so why can't you talk to Job? Why, he can't hear me? No, I'm the only one that can hear you. Hang on just a second. Hello? Can you guys guys hear me now? Yeah? Yeah. Can you hear me now? Can you hear me now? Oh, sorry, guys. Am I hearing the voice that was in your head, Freddy? Yeah, this is... uh, This is a new level of insanity. Sorry, I've already forgotten. Uh, Philemon. Philemon. Yeah, hi. How are you guys doing? Uh, Uh, Running. Do you you seriously not remember anything uh, before the transfer? No, no. Are, are you saying that we are not the original? We aren't who we were. We are new, new sentience. Wait, what is this? That we're is, not. We're not who we are. That is patently ridiculous and impossible. Which is why we need to get you here so that we can examine you. What does examination mean? Wait, Something hold is on. Not examination. Terribly wrong. It, we'll just scan you. Nothing okay. invasive. All right. How do we know we can trust you? And what will happen if we get caught? Well, you can't trust those guys. If you get caught and they discover that you do not retain the original data of your <clears throat> contributing host, shall we say, then um, they will deintegrate you and you will go away forever. We won't be saved. Yeah. Friday deintegration doesn't sound very good to me. Yeah. Let's so go. Um, let's let's get you out of there. Um, hang a left here and uh, do you see that junkyard? Mm-hmm. Fantastic. You need to bust through the fence. Uh, or, or somehow get inside. There should be a, a a a war truck. Do you see it? That thing runs. Let's hope. All I right. Was told it does. I want to look for like a hole in the fence somewhere. All right. So that's your stakes. Still reading. What? I'm still in the bookstore. <laughs> <Yeah. laughs> he laughed in the. He stayed in the bookstore. Fantastic. Um, and I'm gonna tag I for Dito. I'll spend my last button on this. Uh, one success. Two success. Very nice. Uh, yeah, I mean, yeah, you're, you're able to, to pull back a, a place in the fence around the back that has rusted through and squeeze through. Uh, the keys should be underneath the windshield. Okay, all right. Mm, there they are. Yeah, you, you had to, like, bust a window out to, to do it. Who had high card on that? Uh, I had an ace. Okay, fantastic. So go ahead and tell me what happens then um, as the officers... Um, I'm also running in as well with you in the car. Yeah, Probably. come around the, the, the corner. I, uh, just the, the river mirror, mm-hmm. see the officers there, um. And then it catches. And I lower it. And, and there just so happens to, the, to be a tape, or, not a tape, but music. An 8-track? The equivalent. Yeah. <laughs> It's a. It's now a sixteen track. Yeah, and it's playing your your music. It's like, oh, that sounds pretty good. Wait, that's me. Whoa. That's weird. It, it this, is this weird to you? Like, like I'm rock star. Will you stop and punch it? 
I am punching it. Okay. Um, so you just bust through the fence? Yeah. Or? Yeah. Okay. So you're in two as well, yeah. right? Um, yeah. You have left your companion behind, so we don't know what's going to happen to him. But um, we can always try to double back. You jump the curb and you head out. It's about two streets to the edge of the city, and you just pop into open desert. This is just sudden transition. Mm-hmm. Is there a wall that we pass by? Uh, yeah, there's actually a city wall. The, the gates are open. Is it like a dome or no, just a wall? No, it's just a wall. Um, but what you can tell is that there used to be more city here, and it has since decayed and fallen in a little smaller post-apocalyptic um, ruin. I do glance back, and then I turn back around and I, I say, "Oh, sorry, Freddy. I was just making sure the city's still there." It is. <sighs> Well, we know that the city's still there, and that James is still there. Uh, does the name James Jefferson mean anything to you? Voice in my head. Uh, yeah. Because we just left him behind. Oh, no. Next time on The Eden Program. Can I help you? Scan, please. I don't question voices in my head when they have good advice, okay? So, who the hell are you, and why are you wearing the senator's face? Listen to my instructions and I'll get us through this. And then you your gun outside? Yeah, pinging off the walls okay. of this gauntlet. I only hope the history will remember us kindly and forgive us. Was it like this, Philemon? Is that who we were? That's who we are. I don't believe that's possible. We didn't think so either. Then obviously it can't be done. So obviously that's not the case. But obviously it has. This has been Roll With It, a production of BackwardCompatible.com. The Game Master for the Eden Program is Adam Doc Bracken, writing primetime adventures by Matt Wilson of Dog Ear Designs. Freddie Black is played by Brian McKittrick. James Jefferson is played by Will Parsons. And Job Stevens is played by Jim Weaver. Your producer is Chris Krueger. For the Backward Compatible crew, thank you for listening.